what is up guys welcome back to another awesome episode of railroads online my name is evil one and today i have dolan and ovon say hi guys hi i'm not on fire this time no you're not thank thank goodness you survived that ordeal so we need to get our butts up to alaska but before we do that we need to do a couple things first we need to uh, get a coal train configured we need to get coal i guess from the coal mine up there but it's almost out of coal so we need to get some beams and i saw a, a rail car of well rail <laughs> over there in the in the yard that we can take up there too so to fill that up and then we'll bring the coal down configure everything up and get our butts up to alaska sound good sounds good awesome so uh let's see what we have here what do you guys want to do as far as responsibilities on this one? I'm willing to take whatever's left. Okay. Dolan, any, uh, any reference to anything? I know we need a train assembled, but that should wait until after we get uh, the, coal si the coal ordeal situated. Um, are we so Well, how about this? If you want to uh, assemble the coal train, I'll take risk here behind me since it's already warmed up and I'll go hook up to those flat state cars and go get a load of beams and start taking them up to the iron mine. Will that work? Yeah, that works. Man, we got the good brakes. Yeah, you know, that's that bug that they re-implemented to fix the crashing deal. Oh. Um. Well, Dolan, I thought you were in uh, the, the push. No. I beat him to it, apparently. Oh, okay. Well, if you want to line me up, Dolan, we don't want to go into that shed. Go. And the, hit the next switch as well. Nope, 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 other way. There we go, and then the next switch. I see it switched, Dan. Uh, there you go. And then the next switch. <laughs> uh, oh, you, you ran past it. Do you want... Do you want that first rake or the second rake? Because, I mean, they're on both tracks. Yeah, the the inside one here, I think it's a little bit shorter, and we're in risk, so. All right. Come on. <laughs> Capture. Or I thought. Now we're captured. You must have had a little bit of delay. Make sure everything is correct on this train. Make sure there's no brakes. Okay, and we'll hook into this uh, flat state car pressed up against a building here that's got the rails on it. We'll take those up to the coal mine as well. It's over there by that building. I gotcha. Alright, come to a stop. Perfect. Quick, so reverse it forward before you before you come flying yep. up through here. Yep. Well, I'll wait for you. I'm just looking. We don't have a lot of coal in this coal bunker. Might have been nice to. It should be full of coal in the firebox. Might have been a good idea to go get coal as a cooling tower. Uh, you've got no water in the tender. No, oh, really? Yeah, zero out of 9,500. Oh, wow. All right, yeah, we'll make the loop and get some fuel in this thing before we continue on. All right, I'm out of your way. Oops. Sounds good, thank you. Mm -hmm. Let's go. We got a brake on. Probably that last car. I'm already back here. Alright. 
Yep. There we go. So we'll just drive in a big circle around Ironburg, come back to the cooling tower and the water tower and get filled up. Ovon, did you watch that uh, Q&A video? I did. What did you think of it? I'm excited about the idea of having a consist and being able to control multiple engines from the same train. Yeah, oh my goodness. We that just derailed. Huge. We uh, just derailed. Because we got that heavy car at the end of the train. Yeah, and I slammed on the brakes. Not even thinking about it. To run up here and switch the switch. Great. I'll All pull right. the engine forward and we'll just re-rail these really quick. Thank the Lord our couplings are simple now. Right. I oh. can't move. Yeah, you're still connected. There you go. There we go. I've got the water tank. Got it over just looking at it. Turn on. I can't tell if that's over or not. It's probably close enough. Let's see if that water going in works. It's got to move back a little bit. Ooh, this cord wouldn't need to go anywhere. Um, the cord would. Yeah, we're gonna take it with us to Alaska. That's probably enough water. We got about a half a tank or so. All right. I'm gonna shut it off and I'll hop up on the coal tower and coal. then. That should be good. Alright, am I gonna be in your way down here? You guys pulling forward out of the yard? Um I don't see you, so I'm gonna say that we're clear. Okay. I don't know exactly where you're at. I'm down here by the switch house at the far end of the yard, down near where we normally keep the push and shove. Oh. Yeah, we're gonna exit out that way. Okay, I'll just go around the loop then. Okay. That'll keep me out of your way. Uh, it looks about full, Dolan. Okay. Put this back up. Alright. Take her ahead. I know we're gonna have to fix that switch over by the freight depot. Oh. Yeah, that's fine. Alright, I'll fix it over there. One before it or after it? Uh, the one after it. Mm -hmm. We don't loop back around. You'll, you'll need to keep it the way it's going. Yeah, but I can throw right. it when I go through it, is what I'm saying. Oh. Yeah, I'd appreciate it. Yeah, I'm already down here. I see it. Okay. I just noticed that rock in that tree up there. 
That's from my Christmas video. <laughs> nice. Yeah. Me, me and the guys have been working on uh, 12 days of, of uh, railroads online mess. And <laughs> we just like didn't have it done in time. So we, we came up with O oh, Rockin' Stone, O oh, Rockin' or, or Rockin' Tree, O oh, Rockin' Tree. And yeah, we did it here in here, uh, my, my yard on this map is in the same place, so we did it here in the yard. You right. mentioned a passenger train for those who will not be able to go up with us today. Would you like me to assemble that passenger train? Um, if you got the time. Okay. I'll be last on the roster, but if I got the time, I will. Okay. Ah. Uh, uh, I thought this was desync. No, these cars are actually here. Um... Uh, what cars? Passenger I don't, cars. I don't see any cars in front of you. Okay, well, I definitely derailed a caboose, and the second I tried to get on them, they disappeared, and they, oh, did, crap. Derail, they did derail my Ruby Basin. Dolan, can you fix what I just messed up? I'm sorry. Yeah, you're good. Uh, there's no cars in front of you. They're well, all... The second, the second I got on them, they disappeared and went back into the shed. But they definitely derailed my Ruby Basin despite them not being there. Alright, Evil One, you can have the UI back. Okay. I think we got a break on. Start hitting those switches. They'll there are those cranes. They'll start loading. I'll just slowly roll forward. Oh, too slow though. Gotta back up. All right, even one more clear. Fireman, my, my firebox is getting kind of cold. Can you shovel a scoop in there for me? My firebox is acting like we're in Alaska already. Let's take this train up to the coal mine.
coming into the coal mine here. Get all this cargo offloaded. These guys can keep mining that coal out of this mountain. We'll come back up here and pick it up in a little bit. Right on time, number four. Nice. Slow down a little bit more here. Uh, make sure you join my company too, Dolan, if you haven't done so. Sorry, I just remembered to remind you. <laughs> Alright, Evil One, what? floor it. Well, we're going to have to figure out how much coal they actually produced with that. We know how many cars to bring up here. Once we get down, I'll get down there, I'll, I'll head back up real quick. Okay. Okay, so do we want to take these high side gondolas up there that are right here, or do we want to go get the the new ones at the maintenance shed? I mean, they're all they're all the same. I mean, it doesn't really matter whether which ones we really do take. Okay, let's take these ones then. We're already here. Yeah, since we're here, I'll just have to pull forward and back down the line. Ovon, where, where are you operating at right now? So I don't get in your way. Hold on, I'm about to pull in behind you guys, but I'm going into a different track. Or I think I'm pulling in behind you guys. Where are you? We're over at the... Where, where, where we keep the push and shove. Oh, you're farther away than I thought you were. No, I'm at the uh, I'm at the top end of the yard, pulling into one of the... I'm oh, getting, ready to, getting ready to put, put away the, the train that's attached to the... Um, uh, to the, oh, what's it? Not the WNC, the other, the Lima. There we go. Couldn't think of a reward. Yes. <laughs> I'm gonna, I'm gonna pull the, I'm pulling the caboose off it now to put it away. I messed that up. <laughs> I was about to say, why are we stopping? Because I let go of my mouse button. <laughs> <laughs> nice holding the brake lever. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I like I. I know these uh, engines more by their name than I'm by their configurations or by their, you know, what they are. Mm -hmm. Capture. Early on, uh, Let's check these. I was teaching sticks how to play. Cause I gave a five-minute elevator pitch to Styx, and he bought the game. And, nice. and so, like, he wasn't a big train guy, so, like, he he was just, like, the green one or the red one? <laughs> <laughs> you know, I remember, that, that's a, like, this game brought a lot of people in to playing train games to begin with. Yeah. Uh -huh. And it caused people to go check out other games, like Train Simulator and... Uh, Train Sim World, Rolling Line, 
you know, Rolling Lines a fun, a fun VR game. I've Rolling played Lines very little of simulator it. for me. That sounds like something I might enjoy. VR train. So, uh, Rolling Lion is VR model train. Oh, it's model trains. Yep. Okay. It's pretty cool though. You might actually enjoy it. It's just a game you got to pick up and try, really. Okay, here we got these three high side gondolas. We're gonna fill them up here at the coal mine, and we should have enough here to fill these three. So that's good. We'll be bringing these to Alaska. I'll slow it down here. Now these high side gondolas they hold 22 coal per. Which is a whole lot of coal. Oops. It's touchy brakes, man. <laughs> It'll go. Sneak up on these chutes here. We got 83 coal. We can probably do both chutes at the same time. That even work? Up right about there. Good. Let's find out. <laughs> now they use this with 17 coal in the tower. All right. Back to Ironburg. Yep. Back to Ironburg. I'm gonna put you down this this siding. What was siding A? Yeah, I'll put you down siding A, so we can get the train disconnected. And Ovan, where are you, where are you at? Uh, I am putting away a box car, and as soon as I'm done putting this box car away, I'm gonna jump back in uh, reward, and I'm going to put those two box cars full of tools at the front of the in uh, the uh, train we're building. Perfect. Okay. We'll, we will put away Risk and we'll try and switch together the uh, coal train. It's exciting game. Think right about here. I go a little, a little more. That's probably good. All right, you are disconnected. All right. Hey, so uh, how much longer we got to, got to go on this 125? About a week left. I'm just waiting on some last minute parts to arrive. Perfect. Yeah, we got to get it painted too. We also need to come up with a name for it because I do not like the name that it's currently named or the number. So. Clearly Keep don't look a, like a goat to me. Yeah, no. Um, I don't know what they were thinking. But, yeah, keep a... Keep a what's the word I'm looking for? Keep an open mind now. Um, <laughs> think think of uh, something we might want to name this 125. Oh, actually, no. Uh, Dol or, uh, um, Ovon came up with a great name. Uh, what was it? Uh, death and Taxes? Or something yeah. like that? Yeah. Yep. So, so we we'll named it Death. Okay. And right, because it rebirthed. I get where you're going. With yeah, that. exactly. And we'll have to get something else for Taxes. Class 47. Get beauty. We'll do a Class 47 for Taxes. We also got to get Beauty and the Match Beast. And that was what, what engine were we going to buy for Beauty? Um... Mosca, I believe. Yeah. Was it the Mosca? I okay. believe the vote was Mosca. That's gonna be beauty. And then we have uh, death and taxes. Nice. All right, is that engine warmed up yet? Yeah. All right. You want to back it out? Mm 
to break smart on. Smart. Very slowly. the wrong way. We'll run it around the Y real quick. Yeah. Did you get lost? No, some switches weren't set properly. Oh. Oh, you're over here. <laughs> I thought you were going to run all the way around. No. Gotcha. I, was, I didn't see the. That's over there. Switch, switch other, switching other switches for you. <laughs> I thought Good I'd just call. take the easy way. Yeah, you took the Y. I got it. I did not want to stop that sharply. I didn't even put that much brake on. I'll just see Ovon there messing around in the yard back there. Messing around. A little more, please. Doing the real work over here. <laughs> Capture. Did that break? I'm going to check all brakes on all cars. Our go switches ahead. are set. Let's go. Go ahead and get her out of here.
so the journey to Alaska begins. Alright, I'm gonna come into the episode. Well, another long journey. We're finally here on familiar track. Back to Alaska. We have Beast up front with uh, Dolan as the engineer. He's got the cool car. We have Ovon driving reward on this mixed train here. We'll get into the yard here in a few minutes. And uh, we'll probably start breaking these down and get them ready to head to where they need to go. Just derailed. Yeah, you hit that brake kind of hard, Ovon. Yeah. There's a bit of that going around. I, I completely forgot about that bug. I was gonna remind you, and then I was like, oh, let's just see what happens. Uh, uh, am I lined into something other than what you lined yourself into? No. No. Uh, can you back up? Ovon will put you in another lane. Trying to combine the reverser with the brake so that I don't throw the boxcars through the cab. Alright, here we are in the yard. Back in Aurora Falls. I did hear that uh, 
James was bringing a passenger train from Lake Valley up here. So hopefully they'll be along shortly. In the meantime, we got our work cut out here. So anyway, Dolan, uh, you got, you brought some of those couplers, right? For these, all this rolling stock up here and stuff. Perfect. So we'll need to get the, get on that pretty soon, uh, converting everything over so we can actually use the equipment that's here. In the meantime, though, I think we can use uh, Reward and Beast to break down these trains. Uh, the tools they got to go to the. Um, the dredge, the pipe, need to go there as well, along with some coal. So we'll need to configure that train. And the cordwood needs to go to the stamping mill, along with some coal. And the food needs to go to the uh, freight depot to be sold. I'll make sure that everyone joins my company too, please. So we currently have $8,324, so hopefully we can make a little bit of money off these trains here. And we should probably take a load of coal train car too up to the smelter and put a, uh, an order in for coal as well. So, oh I hear a whistle. Mike. You're clear to back up. I already switched them. Hold on. Ah, okay. <laughs> I, yeah, I, I, saw, I saw that. <laughs> little panic mode there. <laughs> Realizing I was the last person who pulled into the yard. There it is. James is coming. The smelter only needs coal, correct? Correct. I would presume it needs a decent amount of it, though, so you may want to use the new gondolas as, as what you take to them. Yeah, make it worth it. And I'll take the in the three EBT hoppers, they'll go to uh, the stamp mill. So I'm going to go ahead and disconnect from those EBT hoppers, because I know I'm gonna, not going to need them. I think the passenger train should probably head down to the uh, freight depot to be the smartest place to put it, since that is technically a station. It is a station. Oh there. Hello. Uh, let me turn that. Oh, that's not my bell. <laughs> well, who's uh, this? Yeah. Yeah. G'day, everyone. Hi, Milzy. Welcome How you to been? Alaska. <laughs> Fantastic. It's great to be here. Great to be back. Nice to have you back. For anyone who may not know, Milzy is one of our original crew members here at the Accidental Death and Dismemberment Railroad. He actually started way back in the day. Uh, for the Ramblin' Railroad. If you go back and look at some of those older episodes, you might know him as... What was your uh, first name? Uh, Captain Slow. Captain Slow, that's right. So, yeah. And now he is, of course, on the development team as a historical researcher, right? That's right. All right. He's going to help us run some trains today as well. So, we're getting... Moving some trains around here. James, if you want to take this passenger train on down to the freight depot, just get it out of the way. Yep. Oh, well. I will. Um, uh, once, uh, once the track's clear, I can take it out. Actually, we're going to need Beast, and there's no good way to turn it around. So just leave it there. That's fine there, I would say. All right. That's a long trip from Australia to Alaska. Millsy. It is, especially in this era. It was months on a ship. <laughs> yeah, 
Yeah, I got yeah. orders to, to <laughs> take a passenger train up here. I wasn't sure why, and then once I got to the station, he was there. It's like, huh. Long time ago. Right. I see. hitchhiked my way over here. <laughs> <laughs> I won the, the ticket on the on the boat One uh, in a game of poker. <laughs> nice. <laughs> Half guard, quarter car, contact. That was way really fast. I'm sorry. All right. <laughs> I wasn't going very fast. I'll turn off these headlamps. Fast. You know, I just realized something. Um, we don't have a good way of turning around these trains. We've got the turntable. Yeah. Individually, it sounds like you're dreading on that. <laughs> what you what you do what you do is you just take the caboose and run it around to the other end of the train. Yeah, we did that on the last one. Oh, um, right. Maybe we should. Why would you do that? Reversing <laughs> loop. And somewhere. I'm thinking that'd probably be a lot easier, a lot faster. <laughs> Maybe down by Is the it? freight depot, there's a bunch of space. But I think that's actually going to do it for this episode. Thank you guys so much for hanging out with us tonight. And uh, I really hope you had a good one. Bye for now.